Hello, welcome back to my channel. This is April. Welcome to Art by April. Yeah. I know last week I wasn't really here. I posted a video. Some of y'all liked it. Some of y'all was like, where you at? I'm here. Um, We're good, Luna. We really got to bring out the squeak toy right now. I didn't even know that had a squeaker in it. The world. Mm. I'm not going to talk about it right now. I'm not. I'm not. Because if you want to see how I feel about anything, you can go to my Instagram. Instagram Art by April. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. The drawing that I'm showing you today is really just a good representation of how I've been feeling. It's not visually upsetting. Let me pull this up. It was a quick drawing. Well, it wasn't supposed to be a quick drawing, but I didn't realize how angry and upset I was when I was doing this. But looking back at it, I could definitely see it. I can see it in all of the, the brush, every stroke. I can see all of my emotions and you probably won't notice at all. With everything that's going on in the world, uh, trust and believe, I don't do like a lot of those like uh, images of people who have died or I don't do a lot of political images because they're upsetting and I use art as a coping skill so if you're wondering why April isn't doing a lot of that that's why I would be completely upset during the entire process so I don't I, ju I just steer clear of it so I really wanted to do like an up close type portrait because I really wanted to focus on um, like facial features, skin and reflections and everything like that. I had the best intentions for this piece. It's just that, and it didn't turn out bad. It's just that I can really see all of the emotions I had at that time. You ever have that? You ever see a piece that you've done and you remember how you felt during that time of like, like maybe a month or so or however long it took you to do the piece? That, that's how I'm feeling with this piece here. This is like, I can see it. You may not be able to see it, but I can see it. And I could have done like a, a neat, perfect outline for it. But instead I chose to keep all of the very expressional sketch layer showing on purpose because I know how I was feeling. And I, I don't want to like, blow that off or make it seem like, like when you do an outline layer it it really just condenses all that sketch work down and that's where all the emotion is that's where all the craziness in this piece is okay I feel like I'm really dragging this I'm really dragging this video down okay that's not how I want to handle this channel <laughs> by the way we almost at 1k so subscribe that first one k i'm gonna keep this video nice and quick it's guys yeah, we made it through mermaid congratulations if you made it through mermaid luna can you say congratulations I don't want to complain or rant on this channel, so let's keep it positive. I just said that. I said keep it positive. This video is probably going to be up a little late. Yesterday, Trenton, the area I live in, in New Jersey, um, experienced like wide blackouts. So the day I was supposed to be filming this and editing this, we have no power, so, or internet access. Luna? So hopefully we're all gonna have a better, bro, it's not, it's not gonna get better, April Jama. Hopefully everybody is just gonna stay safe and sane. I really wanted to end this positively, but I don't know if I have enough positivity in me to do that. Nope. Subscribe!